Got him in a Bridger number five on a drowner set here. Decent sized beaver. Not a great big one, but first one of the season, I'll take it. Well, we're out checking our beaver traps this morning, and uh, I had a Duke number three here with a drowner. I had a couple pieces of corn sitting up here for the beaver to see. I was trying it out, and it looked like it worked. So we'll pull it in and see if we got a beaver on the end of it. Yep, there he is. We can get him up out of here. I made these drowners the other night on 330 seconds caving. This is the uh, this is the second beaver we took out of this hole right here. We uh, took one out of here the other day, and then on down from here we pulled two out of there. So that's four beaver down here so far. Size all the other ones. We're gonna do a remake on this beaver set here. Put this back out here. Take a beaver out of this spot. I have to come back and put some more beaver caster here. Got some corn up here for just a visual tracking. Seemed to work pretty good. We didn't catch nothing in this set the night before last. We did the night before that. But maybe we'll have another in here in the morning. Fine beaver in a 280. Looks like a pretty big one. Got one of the trap down here. Let's go down and check it. Didn't have nothing in it yesterday neither. So maybe today there's some fresh beaver chewing. That wasn't there last night. Maybe we got a double. Oh yeah, baby. A double on beaver today. That's good. We'll get these reset and maybe pull some more tonight. Yeah. Here's the three beaver sets I just put back in. We had two here this morning and caught two. Uh, 54, I think, or 53 and a 43 pounder. So here's one. I will put another one right here, but I think I'll hold off and wait and see what happens tonight, if I see more beaver in the area or not. Here's set number two. I picked up a while back on using corn. Uh, I've used it so far and I'm Pulled a pretty good bit of beavers today. There's set number three. And there's my safety setter. I about forgot it. Well, there they are. Uh, we'll come back in the morning and check them and see how they do. Got us another one last night. Not no big one, but it's a beaver. Let's get on and check the rest of our line this morning. Put a dry land beaver set in here. Had the trap right here. Yesterday, we had a beaver got into it. It's a Duke number three, and uh, just got the back part of it split in it. It actually had the toe still in the trap, but we didn't have a beaver. I went ahead and reset it back anyways. Come back this morning, we got this big giant muskrat in here. See if I can get him up here where you can see how big he is. He's a stud. I ain't about to reach down there and touch him. That is a giant whopper rat right there. And prime well, too. This is my dry land beaver set. Uh, two days in a row we've got two fairly good sized muskrats in it. <clears throat> Kinda like to get some beaver, but 
I'll take what I can get. Here we had our dry land and beaver set here. Uh, we pulled two muskrats, one yesterday and one the day before. And we got a beaver in it this morning, a decent size one. It's a uh, front foot catch. Get on up here, you can look at his foot in it. Come over here if you look. So watch out getting too close to that thing. He'll jump up there and get you. Well, yep, we got us another beaver this morning. The water dropped last night about another foot or so. These sets was in half, in half out of the water. But we got one in this 280. Get him up here and see how big he is. Uh, big, decent sized beaver. I'd say somewhere around the, oh, probably 30, 35 pound mark. Well, we come in here this morning I'm gonna pull traps and uh, we got us another beaver and a bridger number five. It's been a few days since we pulled one in this. Water dropped down a lot last night. I can see my drowning bag out there. And we'll go ahead and get him took care of. <laughs>